Welcome to episode 1766, Michael S. Smith, from college dropout to LNG, self-made billionaire. Pictures of him and his wife, Iris. It's an outline of episode 1766. Now, I had to do extensive research on LNG before I started Freeport LNG. After selling my oil and gas business in 2001, I was convinced that the U.S. was starting to run out of natural gas, that essentially our gas reserves were declining too, too fast to keep up with demand. He was born in Bronx, New York in 1955. In the 1970s, he was a pre-med student majoring in chemistry, minor in mathematics at Colorado State University. Drop out to become a ski bum at Vail Resort. First job was a real estate agent, and he worked there for three years. How he made $60 million by the age of 45. 1981, he founded oil and gas exploration company, Basin Exploration and he sold it to Song Energy in 2001. Next, in 2002, he founded Freeport LNG, need to adapt for success. One of the first things that's necessary for successfully adapting to changes in the life and the business world, once you've analyzed the road ahead and you decided to chart Unreal, you need to realize you're going to be the weakest person in your field and you need to swim and keep up with the other fish or national, natural selection will do you in. When I started in the oil and gas industry, I had no prior experience in the field. In 2002, he founded Freeport LNG in Texas. It was a mistake in the beginning. Mitz, he initially got his bet wrong. Back in 2002, when he got his start on Quintana Island, Smith's strategy was not to export LNG at all, but to import it. Indeed, he first raised $800 million to build an import terminal that by 2008 was obsolete before it was even completed. Having been the first mover in a failed strategy, though, put Smith in prime position to reverse course and export, rather than import, LNG. Still a billion people in the world without electricity um, and they want a piece of the pie that we take for granted. His cash flow is now five billion dollars a day. Michael Smith has a net worth of 2.6 billion dollars. He's 67 years old. Secret of his success is that you don't just build this export facility and not have customers. They convinced these buyers in South Korea and Japan and China to enter into 20-year contracts. He knows how much money Freeport LNG is going to make pretty much every year for the next two decades. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe, leave your questions and comments below. My next video will be Michael S. Smith, Nine Lessons. Wishing everyone peace and prosperity.